up y'all so um i'm going to show y'all how to make those um slashed shorts i just learned how to make them from someone in um, a sewing group i'm in we're actually doing a challenge so i was going to record me um participating in the challenge as well so what i did here these are a right and a left short but i taped it in the middle to make it like this so that the shorts come out like this okay so what heaven said to do is to sew sew down the sides first so this machine right here is my serger okay so let me go ahead and get in position so i can use it and when you're using a serger uh make sure let me fix the camera a little bit when you're using a serger make sure your fabric fabric i said fabric fabric is uh right sides facing so the negative sides will show on both sides and make sure you're holding your fabric on the sides and you're going to push it up on the serger okay and you're gonna put your foot down Pull it back just a little bit so my um, serger needles are going where I need it to go. Okay. And you got to make sure you hold the fabric when you're using it or it's going to be all off and then you'll have to redo it. So hold on one second. And be careful using the serger because there is a razor on the side that cuts fabric and <laughs> you don't want to fuck up simple as that we're not going to do the crotch we're just doing the side Okay, we gotta do the other side. I think my little tool is getting dull, babe, because it shouldn't take this long for me to cut this. Might have to buy me another one. All right, now for the other side, you'll have to do it upside down, sort of especially with you being right-handed. Now for left-handers, I don't know exactly how you would, you know, use the serger because I ain't like uh, left-handed. So I'm sorry about that. I can't, <laughs> I can't advise you on that. All right, so like I said, make sure the corners are even, add it up, let your foot down. Okay, put your needles down. Might need to pull this back just a little more. All right. Hold it on the sides so it don't move. And be careful of the razor. Mm, see, mine's cutting a little bit, but that's okay. Sometimes you might have a little bit of extra fabric and you know, the serger will go ahead and get rid of that for you. Now you see what I'm doing? Might need to move you a little closer. Sorry for the wobbliness, but this is a pretty good uh, <laughs> tripod I got from Five Below. But anyway, so hold your ends together and finish it off. 
Then cut your tails off at the, the start of your uh, project. I think my little tool that I got in the package, this is, you know, little snippers you use to cut uh, thread. I think it's starting to get dull. Okay, anyway, so we got the sides done like she said to do okay then she said we're gonna fold them in half okay fold them in half let me move y'all back so y'all can see All right, so since we got the shorts surged and everything, okay, make sure everything evened up. This area, she said right here, avoid cutting because this is the area that covers the crotch. So what we gonna do, and I'm gonna turn this around so I can use it with my right hand. Uh, so we gonna do, let's see here. And folding it in half like this, uh, make sure that the other side gets cut too. Sorry if it got blurry. I had no idea <laughs> that the low battery notification came up. Okay. Then what she said to do was to cut on the end. So let me move this over so y'all can see. So right here right here right here and right here all right and then we're gonna open them up <laughs> and this is how they look right here so let me go ahead open these and get ready to do the crotch area. So we're gonna put these two together. When you're doing the crotch area, make sure your seams are matching up. You don't wanna be walking around and your seams is off. Pay attention to your clothes. Look at your seams on your clothes and see how they add up. Okay, so I'm gonna surge this real